We are going to have a lesson on basic science and our topic is forms of energy. Let's look at the specific objectives before we go to our main lesson. At the end of this lesson, you should be able to define energy and list various forms of energy let's say the meaning of energy energy is the ability to do work energy is all around us and we use it every day it makes things move change or happen like living things need energy to grow, move, breathe, and feed. And also we need energy to cook food, ride a bicycle, and jump in the air. Let's see forms of energy. We have two main types of energy. There are potential energy and kinetic energy. When we talk about potential energy, it's stored energy. It is also the energy that a body possesses as a result of its position in relation to other things. For example, when you're resting, at that moment your body has potential energy because you are not moving. And also, a battery has potential energy because the energy is being stored for use. And under potential energy, we have other forms of energy. We have the chemical energy, which is stored in the food we eat and the fuel we burn. So mechanical energy, which is stored in a mechanical object by tension. Three, electrical energy, which is stored in a battery. And electrical appliances convert electrical energy into forms of kinetic energy. Now let's look at kinetic energy. Kinetic energy is the energy an object possesses because of its movement or motion. This form of energy happens when you are playing a game, riding your bicycle, or even doing your homework. Whenever you're moving, you're using kinetic energy. Then on the kinetic energy, we have other forms of energy, like light energy, sound energy, heat energy, and motion energy. Like light energy is energy that travels as a wave. Then sound energy is the movement of energy in waves. Sound waves are produced when an object or substance vibrates. Then energy is transferred through the substance in the form of a wave. Then heat energy is created by the movement or vibration of atoms and molecules in a substance. Then motion energy is the movement of people, animals, 
and objects from one place to another. Before we end our lesson, let's go back for better understanding. First, we define energy as the ability to do work. And we mention two types of energy, the potential energy and kinetic energy. And I said potential energy is stored energy. Well, kinetic energy is the energy of motion. Then on the potential energy, we have other forms of energy. They include chemical energy, mechanical energy, and on the kinetic energy, we have other forms of energy. They include light energy, heat energy, sound energy, etc. Now for your homework, you're going to answer the following questions. Number one, what is energy? Two, mention the two main types of energy. Three, mention two forms of potential energy and kinetic energy. 